A former GBI investigator and candidate for sheriff is Mayor Lester Miller's pick to run Megan Bibbs Code Enforcement. J.T. Rickinson is one of the recommendations for county department heads announced to commissioners this afternoon. New at 11, Ashlyn Webb spoke to Rickinson and Miller about the announcement. Mayor Lester Miller says he's recommending J.T. Rickinson to be the county's bulldog to bust blight. So we need somebody that's a real go-getter, uh, somebody that can be a bulldog to, to an extent. I love charging hills and I love running after things. So yes, I, I, they, they may have to pull me back in some, but my, my intent will always be to make this a safer community. Miller says he chose Rickinson because he understands the court process and can manage a big caseload. I'm not going to let any uh, structure, uh, un, uninhabitable area or whatever, slip by or fall through the cracks, we're going to have an accountability system that I'll put in place that will be second to nobody. But Miller says he was his pick also because of his experience with public safety. Rickinson worked at the GBI for about 36 years, the last seven years as special agent in charge over the Perry office. Rickinson says there's a connection between blight and crime, another reason the county needs to get stricter with code enforcement. When you allow um, uninhabitable houses or unsafe houses to exist in a neighborhood, what happens is the criminals ride through there and they think, well, maybe these residents here don't really care. But when we pick up the trash and we clean up these abandoned houses and we bulldoze them down that are, that are basically uninhabitable, the message is a clear message that we send to all criminals that we care about this community and your criminal activity is not welcomed here. Right now, the county says several thousand blighted structures need to be inspected and put through the code enforcement and court process. Rickison says as director, he and his team would map out the areas most affected by blight and give them special attention. Now again, this is just a recommendation at this point, but commissioners are set to vote on this next week. Reporting in Megan, Ashlyn Webb, 13 W Amazing News. Miller's other choices for department heads include Henry Ficklin as Director of Community Affairs, Cherise Stevens as Small Business Director, and Frank Lawson as Procurement Director.